What is going on, everybody? Thank you again, as always, for checking out the videos. Appreciate it. If you haven't already, like every YouTuber says, go hit that subscribe button, go hit the like button, comment, all of that good stuff. Watch this video twice, three times. But anyway, let's get into it. So I realized like I was on the MacBook editing like another video that I'm gonna put out after this one. And I realized like, okay, I got a lot of the workouts that's just sitting on the computer doing nothing. It's just sitting on the drive, just destroying the amount of space on these drives. And I realized like, okay, I need to start getting these things out because I'm shooting more than I'm putting them out and they're just there and it's just like, okay, they're not getting used and I wanna start utilizing it a little bit more. So what I wanna start doing is just start, just start putting it out there. And I know I said before, like, okay, you know, I'm trying to, t you know, put the workouts on a back burner and not really highlight it, but no, I have to look at it differently. No, I definitely wanna highlight it. I definitely wanna show it because it's a part of this whole thing that we're doing on this channel, you know, along with being mentally sound and mentally focused, but we have to be physically as well. And a lot of the attributes mentally that we have and that we focus on is what goes into the training, you know? And it's like, I'm not gonna be here always in every video telling you about the form and how many reps and sets, you know, we'll definitely have those videos for sure. But I just wanna show you guys what's going on day in, day out. Like, it's not just, okay, I'm at the gym once a week, twice a week, and I see you later. I'm in there six, seven days a week, you know, one to two times a day before and after work. You know, the people that I train with, they're, they're putting in hours of work. We're in that academy. We're doing jujitsu. We're at the academy for like three hours some nights, you know, because we have the class. Then we do, you know, conditioning afterwards. So if we're getting out of there. It's like, you know, it's been like two and a half hours. And I want to start showcasing that and start showing that side of it that, OK, yes, the workouts, you know, it's different forms. And OK, try this and the bands and the chains and all that is 100 percent important. And it's definitely going to be something I'll start touching on. But I want you guys to just take heed and just notice of the work ethic and the discipline and the drive and the focus that not only that I put in into it, but you're going to start to see, you know, my people that that's on these videos, you know, what they're doing, they're putting in the work, you know, and that's the type of energy that I'm surrounding myself with and just have this mastermind group that if I feel like, OK, I don't want to do this today, I'm tired, blah, blah. I already know walking into that room that they're going to try to kill me because they got love for me and they love me to death. And that's, and that's the same for them. I'm trying to kill them because I got a ton of love for them. I love them to death. And the way we show that is by going hard, is, is we're not letting up on the training. You know, we're staying focused, we're, we're driving, we're working. So it keeps me accountable and also keeps them accountable. And I wanna start highlighting that side of training, that side of working out, you know, that work ethic, that grit, that grind, that hustle, that not only that you have to put in to your workouts, but you have to just put it to anything that you're doing. But you see how it spills over to different facets of your life, you know, business, relationships, you know, whatever, that it all spills over and it's all similar principles. We just have to apply it in just different ways. So I'm going to definitely start showing more of the workouts. A lot of it is just, I just let the camera just go and it just captures whatever it captures. We're just going to put it out there. So, and a lot of it will be edited down and I'll make it look, you know, do what I do with the editing. But a lot of it, I don't want to edit. I don't want to edit anything. I just want it to be like, look, this is it. This is what's going on in here. Straight up 30 minutes. We're getting it in. No breaks, no nothing. You know, I want to showcase that. You know, when I'm in the gym, I want you guys to just see this isn't, this is an all day, not all day, but this is a, a everyday kind of situation to where I have to be accountable for no matter what's going on in my life. You know, how busy my day is, I have to make sure I allocate my time for my workout. I have to allocate my time for my therapy, first and foremost, because for me, the workout isn't just, OK, I'm trying to get swollen, I'm just trying to get diesel. It's way beyond that. You know, that's that's the least of the concern, because if you put the work in, you're going to reap the, the benefits. Listen, if you come to jujitsu and you stay consistent, you're going to be a blue belt. You're going to be a purple belt. You're going to be a brown belt. You're going to be a black belt. If you're putting in the necessary work, time and energy that it requires. If you're in the gym lifting, 
putting in the work, watching your macros, and really focusing on it, you're going to get the size. You're going to get swole. You're going to get big, all that good stuff. So I'm not worried about that. You know, for me, it's my therapy. You know, I could be having a shitty day, which a lot of times I'm waking up just, you know, we're not even going to get into that. And okay, let's get to the gym. That's why I like to get there as early as possible. You know, the gym is opening at 5 a.m. I want to get there 4.50. You know, I'm, I'm there the latest sometimes. Okay, I'll get there at 6. But I want to start my day off because all of that negative energy that I might have already, I can just put it all into the workout, all into the weights, you know, or later that evening, put it into jujitsu and just, you know, have this a clear head and then and get the answers that I'm looking for. And a lot of times I get the answer that I'm looking for through just that hard, brutal workout, you know, that hard, brutal training session. You know, for me, when I'm rolling, when I do jujitsu, I got to take it to the point where I almost feel like I'm going to pass out. I have to take I, I take it to the point that I feel like I'm going to die because that's the only way I feel like I'm living. You know, it, it's just this weird thing. And I want to touch on that a little bit more in a different video because I know I'm already rambling, but I have to do that. You know, that's my therapy, you know, for me to have a clear thought process, have a clear head to now, OK, go out and attack the world and do what you got to do. I have to make sure I'm somewhat level headed. I'm somewhat clear on my thoughts so I can go and get it. And I get that through my workouts and through my jujitsu. So with saying all that, more videos, more workout videos, going to be doing more Q&A's, all of that stuff, breaking down macros, breaking down why I do certain exercises. So in the meantime, let's get to these videos. Another one is definitely on the way. Let's get it.